Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. We are in the port city of Porto, and this unmistakably the Estadio do Dragao. Blue, certainly the colour. And here is the national anthem of Panama. They have thrown down the gauntlet with that anthem, now to match it. The information we've been given is that they're going to go with a 3-5-2. Well, I can tell you, Peter, that I actually always like playing in this formation because as a wing-back, you get more freedom to go forward. As an orthodox full-back, you had to be more selective in the runs you made. The back three should be able to deal with certainly one opposition striker and, and possibly two. And that's why I liked it, because I didn't have to get back that much. the whistle keeper sends it forward well played he saw that coming and now they can launch a counter plays it out to the wing oh, well intercepted really alerts the danger Beautifully done. Tries to stroke it through. It is a corner. Time to deliver. Tries to swing it in. Pinged forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Forward it goes. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. And the through ball is intercepted. it towards the front
Played into space out wide. Has a goal! Oh, good interception. Either side really getting hold of the ball. That is terrific skill. Ball driven towards the far post. Tries to get it forward quickly. Breaks on here. Forward it goes. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Tries to locate someone up front. Hoists it forward. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Looks to bypass the midfield. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's played forward. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Oh, he's been flattened there. Oh, it's a mistimed tackle, and it is a penalty. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Feeling they've missed the penalty, but they have to find a guttiness themselves from here. Hoists it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Has he found his man? Done very well to intervene. Goes direct to the front line. Tries to get it forward quickly. Panama. Referee's had a look. And he's blown his whistle for half time. So the other team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals the first half compared with your expectation well this has proved a very frustrating day so far especially for the strikers nothing has been created for them I think the service has been extremely poor and the action is back on the way nil nil then and we're back on the way he's making good use of his strength there just refuses to be out muscled. Forward it goes. Gets his head to it. He's got away with one there. Up towards the front line. Hit long and direct. Oh, the less said about that pass, the better. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. That's been drilled forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's being played forward. Well positioned to make that interception. Quick ball forward. Looking to hit the front line. He's made sure that that won't get through. It's 
Still nothing to reflect upon in terms of goals here. It is 0-0. Played in with accuracy. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. It's found its way to him. Hoists it forward. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Tries to dink it in. Tries to locate someone up front. Played forward, gets into a dangerous position. There's one quality pass away from being a very decent chance, but very promising. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Forward it goes. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Almost 75 minutes on the clock now. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a huge old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because Respective defences have been strong. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Good idea, just poorly executed. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hoists it forward, and it's played forward, cuts it out. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Forward it goes. Out to the left it goes. Crossed in. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Tries to get it forward quickly. Panama really are enduring a, a frustrating spell when it comes to trying to move the ball around the midfield. They, they lack the sharpness. So that's it, it is all over. And it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. A little craft or guile or penetration. Defences largely untroubled. It's goals. Your reflections then, Jim. Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even and no complaints. My thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.